Welcome to Get Healthy UTV. I am Chris Freitag, and I am so happy to be here with your shoulders bicep tricep workout. Now, this workout maybe is great to add on at the end of a cardio workout, and you just want to get a quick 10 minute upper body workout, or maybe you did one of our circuit workouts where you used your whole body, but you still want that extra upper body. I've got it for you today. Shoulders, thighs, and tries. Now, ladies, as you get older and you complain about crepey skin, let me tell you, you can rub cream on all day long, but you got to start lifting some weights. You want to get a, you know, some sculpted arms. You want to feel stronger with your everyday movements. You got to do a little extra. So today I'm going to go a little heavier. We're going to do four shoulder exercises. Okay, where the buys and tries will be helpers. Then we're gonna do two bicep, two tricep. We're gonna repeat it once. So stay with me, team. Here we go. Ready? Big deep breath up. We'll just do a one minute warm up. Again, I talk all the time about how warm ups are about mobility. Mobility is about the joints. It's mobilizing those joints, getting some fluid moving in your joints to um, stay healthy. And when your joints are healthy, then you can work on those muscles. Right there. They say that range of motion is the fountain of youth. When you can move with big range of motion, you feel better. This is for your shoulders, ball and socket joint, reverse circle right here, and then you're gonna take it the other direction, internal rotation, this way. So we're just lubricating those shoulder joints right there. After all, this is a shoulder, by and try workout. And then we'll just flap our wings right here. Beautiful, I love it. Let's just punch our arms out to the side right there. We're getting the upper body ready to move, get some blood pumping, joints moving, three, two, and that's really it. Okay, we're starting with overhead presses. Now, I want you to go heavy. I'm grabbing 15, so you tell me what works for you. We're doing 12 repetitions of each exercise. You're gonna take those weights and rack them up at the shoulders. Keep your shoulders away from your ears. Do not use your neck or your traps. Are you ready? I'm staggering my stance. Slightly soften your knees and keep your abs tight so you do not overarch your low back. One, two, press them up there. Breathe each time. Come on, breathe, seven, eight, are you with me? Nine, 10, 11, we're doing a dozen of each one, 12. Now, if you feel zero fatigue, then that is your cue to go a little heavier. We're moving to lat raises, I'm dropping to my 12s. Lat raises are like you're taking two pitchers of water, dumping them out, and then squeezing an orange under your armpit. Very weird visual, I know. Here we go. And one, two, do not use your neck. Three, four, abs are tight, don't arch your back. Five, breathe each time, six, come on baby. Seven, you should start to feel some muscle fatigue. Eight, nine, 10, come on. 11, 12, fabulous. Moving to shoulder tees, we're gonna use our front and back shoulder. Your shoulder has three heads. Medial head, which is right here, the top of the shoulder, the deltoid, uh, medial deltoid. Then you have your anterior deltoid, front shoulder, and posterior deltoid, the back. We're gonna do our shoulder T's, working all three heads. Here we go. Breathe, up, out, and down. That's one. Up, out, and down slow. That's two. Up, out, and down. Now I dropped to eight pounders because this gets harder for me to keep from using my neck. This is five. Are you breathing? Six, it gets a little harder. Seven, I'm starting to feel that muscle fatigue. Eight, trying not to engage my traps. Nine, oh baby. 10, mm. should be getting more difficult. 11, last one, you got this. And. Breathe, awesome. Now, fatigue is starting to set in for me. Like I said to you, if you feel nothing, that means you can go have your rear delts. We're gonna now focus more on the back of the shoulder. This movement is front shoulder. We're gonna flap our wings and engage our posterior deltoid. We don't use it that much during the day, and so it's really good to strengthen it so you don't end up with poor posture, but you can keep your body upright. Now, I'm gonna stagger my stance. One foot forward to protect my low back, abs are tight. Hinge over from your hips. I'm staying with my eight pounders for this. And I'm gonna flap my wings to the side and back. So what I don't want you to do is this. Are you ready? That was one for me. Two, three, four, five. Now if you're going slower than me, that is fine. Six, try not to go faster. I want you to use heavier weights. Seven, 
eight, come on team, nine, 10, 11, and 12. We're moving into our bicep curls. Now I'm gonna go back to heavy. Your biceps can handle it. 12 bicep curls, palms face in, here we go. One, slow on the way down. Two, slow on the way down. Three, don't swing from your upper body, don't swing your elbows. Was that four? We got it. Five, slow on the lower because that's the eccentric part of the muscle where you're lengthening it, you'll get more um, for your money. All right, that's six maybe. Seven, I'm not a very good counter and talker. Eight, come on biceps. Nine, come on. 10, 11, are you going heavy enough where you feel fatigue? 12, we'll go right into a tricep exercise. I'm gonna stay with my 15s. You tell me what you can do. Arms are overhead, shoulders in, elbows in. Don't let your elbows fan to the side. I want you to bring it all the way down behind you, all the way down, all the way up, that's one. All the way down, all the way up, that's two. Elbows stay in. Three, we're using the long head of the tricep. Four, right there. Five, come on. Six, you got it. Seven, eight, are you breathing? Fatigue should be setting in. We've got two more. You can do this. Come on, come on. Bam. Tricep push-ups. I'm going on my knees. I want your elbows pointing directly behind you, hands on the floor or on a chair or right on the edge of your waist. Pull your hips in alignment. Keep those elbows in tight. One, two, three. Keep them in. Come on. Four, five, six, seven. Breathe. Eight, nine. Bang them out, come on, 10, Woo, two more, 11, 12. Those are the hardest push-ups on the planet. And we'll do some hammer curls to finish it out with the biceps. Here we go, one, that, just like you're hammering, you keep the, the weights facing this way. Two, bring it down, three, don't swing the arms. Four, five, come on, six, seven, eight, Nine, you got it. 10, let's go team. 11. Oh. Okay, we're doing one more round. We're gonna go a little faster. Now I know I said I wanted you to go, not go too fast. I don't want you to use really light weights and whip them. I want you to really focus on your muscle. Muscle fatigue is our goal. So you're just taking that quick break. We start with overhead presses. We're gonna go right through all the exercises. Are you ready? 12 of them, let's go. One. Two, think about form. Three, come on. Four, fatigue is really gonna set in on this second set, that's six. Seven, eight, nine, 10, you've got it. 11, 12, that was getting hard for me. Lat raises, dump the water out of the pitcher, squeeze the orange under your armpit. Here we go, team. One, two, three, Four, breathe. Mm. All right, here comes number seven for me. How about you? Hey, count out loud if you need to, if you're going at a different time than I am. I've got two more. Let's go, baby. Right there. Woo! Shoulder tease. We're gonna drive it the other way this time. So we're gonna come this way. Up, out, I'm sorry, up, in, and down. That's one. Up, in, and down, that's two. Up, these are getting heavy. Three, mm. four. Now with that anterior deltoid, front of the shoulder, it's a little smaller muscle group, so it makes sense that you lower down. I don't know, was that six? I hope it was. Seven, I'm focusing on not scrunching my neck. Eight, if it gets to be too much, you can do one arm at a time. Nine, come on. 10, you can see I'm struggling. I'm working hard. I might have dropped down to fives if I had them at this point. Woo! Oh, that's 12. Rear delts, shoulders up, back and down. Give them a little relax. All right, here we go. Hinge forward from those hip flexors, abs are tight. One, two, three, four, you got it. Five, six, come on. Seven, eight, 
nine. Flap those wings, squeeze your shoulder blades. Two more, bam. Okay, buys and tries. We're almost there, team. Bicep curls, slow on the eccentric part of the muscle um, of the movement. That's the lengthening. That's where you're gonna get that gain. Don't swing the upper body. Here we go. One, two, three. I went back to heavy. Four, I'm starting to shake a little bit. It's getting hard. Five, six, think about good form. Don't swing your body. Seven, yes you can. Eight, oh baby. Nine, all right, let's go team. Give me two more. Squeeze those biceps. Woo! And, oh, you got it. Tricep overhead, extensions. Relax those shoulders, pull those weights up. Tell me what you're gonna use. I'm sticking with my 15s if I can. Here we go, all the way down. One, two, try not to get the hair in your ponytail. Three, all the way down. Four, you've got it. Five, the sweat is now starting to drip, drip down my back. Six, seven, eight. If I miscount, I'm apologizing right now. You do you. I've got two more. Let's go. Bam. Tricep push-ups. Whose idea was that, right? Okay. If you go on your toes, you might be going slower than me. If you have those fingertips facing away. Elbows are touching the sides of the rib cage, quite possibly. Are we ready? Go. One, two. Oh, my goodness. Three. Holy bananas. Four, five, six. Come on. Seven, eight. Holy cow, we can do it. Nine, you keep going. 10, it's just a 12. Come on, team. Woo. All right, big finish. Hammer curls. Let's go, 12 of them. That's all we got left. You guys are awesome. One, pound the nail. Two, pound that nail. Three, control it. Four, come on, baby. Five. Six, oh yeah, seven, are you breathing? Eight, big finish. Nine, 10, all right, give me two more. Two more for the win. Yes, and one more. Mm. And that just happened. Woo, okay, I'm not sure I can drive my car right now. <laughs> Good job, everyone at home. Remember, muscle fatigue is your friend when you are working out your muscles, you've got to break them down to build them up. And don't be afraid of getting bulky, ladies, because that's not going to happen with our hormone makeup, even if you are postmenopausal like me. So don't worry about it. We're stretching our shoulder here. Other side. That was awesome. Breathe. Make sure you hydrate. 10 minutes does a lot. Right there. All right. So check out another GHU TV 10 minute workout or perhaps you're a member and you try one of our longer workouts and thank you as usual for working out with me.